ADHD. Does having it make you a better streamer? You bet your ass it does. <laughs> And I'll prove it. As someone who was diagnosed with severe ADHD at a very young age, I'm qualified to speak on this. And if you disagree, well, ah. Uh... Twitch has become the mecca for people with ADHD. Mizkif, Susu underscore JPG, and Code Miko are a couple of the many streamers who have come out of the ADHD closet. Wait, can I say that? Dude. All right, but let's just take a look at Mizkif, who is pretty much the poster boy for people with severe ADHD. This is a video of Mizkif as a child. You see his inability to sit still, pay attention, or follow the rules? This is my childhood. Dude, what am I doing? And I know you remember a couple classmates like this. Now, let me paint you a picture. You know that feeling when you haven't eaten all day and all you can think about is just finding some food and just stuffing it in your mouth? That's what it feels like to have severe ADHD. But the only way to satiate that hunger is by getting the attention of others, dancing or just moving around, or stuffing your face with food, among other things. But the feeling is never satisfied until you're so tired that you just sit there and watch hundreds of hours of YouTube videos where is my life gone? Now, imagine someone trying to constantly get your attention. Pretty annoying, right? As a kid growing up with ADHD, you start to realize that everyone finds you annoying, but you still crave that attention. So hopefully you learn to adapt. When I get someone's attention, it has to be a positive experience for them. Thus you learn to make people laugh and become the class clown. Inevitably you start making fun of other people and then you realize I'm a bully and most people don't like bullies. Negative reinforcement leads to more adapting. Right, stupid? I'll, I'll do better. And then you start making fun of yourself. I'm 22, and this is me now. And that right there is the gold mine. <laughs> now, what's the hardest part of streaming? It's live, so you have to constantly hold the attention of the audience all on the spot so they don't click off your stream. Holding people's attention is a skill a lot of people with ADHD have been perfecting their whole life. And streamers are making millions of dollars nowadays. And so what I'm trying to say is all you therapists and teachers who tried to change me as a child, you can go fuck yourself. I can monetize this shit now, baby.